Good morning, good morning. It is Sunday, the 11th of December, and I'm doing my 50th half marathon. I am going to get there. I'm gonna get there. Well, I come out this morning expecting to do a half marathon. Didn't expect to do it in Arundel, if I'm being completely honest. Look at this, ridiculous. And even more ridiculous when you consider the fact that we've just been knocked out of the World Cup. You know, usually I'm running through vomit, broken glass, and the lingering air of aggression. But not today. Everyone's as ambivalent about it as uh, Gareth Southgate appeared to be. Oh, let's not go there. I think I'm going to have to get on that canal, get some traction. Well, here I am, safely on the canal. But look at it, it's beautiful. About minus three. Just ran past the penguin, no word of a lie. Flash git wearing one of those Canada Goose coats, walking his dog. He's looked at me and went, Said, yeah, tell me about it, mate. Gave him a salute. Always good to show a little bit of respect, to be honest with you, because I've met him before, and he reckons he's an emperor from where he's from. If you have a look down, there, frozen solid. Some idiots will come down here a bit later. About 14, on Halfords branded cycles, lugging bricks in, and presumably their bikes as well. It's gotta be some explanation why they always end up in here. Look, I know some of you are worried about this, but the best Christmas present you can get me this year is 35 subscribers. That's all I need to get me to 400, 35. Now remember your obligation, this is what you agreed to, was to get me two each. Some of you aren't pulling your weight. I need 35 more. That's all I'm asking. I don't want a lot for Christmas. There's just one thing I need, get me some subbers. Get me some subbers. It's always interesting to see how nature adapts to this sort of thing, these cold temps. Me, I've gone for a couple of layers, but I've made a fatal error. One of them sweat wicking, one of them isn't. Sweat wicking where basically the sweat is soaked from the body and released out during the garment. Tip for you, don't wear a sweat wicker underneath one that's not sweat wicking. Because you've got this one here that's working its plums off. This one, it's like a kid at work experience at a factory, he's just sitting down, he's given up. All right? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing though, do I? I'll give up. Oh, it's too hard, I think I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it, it's boring. Oh, what's the worst that can happen if I leave it? Anyway, it'll get cold. I am getting cold, actually. Freezing. But it is interesting to see how nature adapts. You know, I just came across a little moorhen, literally, just skittered across my path. He obviously been ditched by his mates last night, trying to get home. He just looked at me. Did you see any more hens around here? I said, no, mate, just you. And he looked at me and he went, as if to say, what am I going to do? Adapt or die, man! Come on, get a grip. Adapt or die. Never seen a fox. Goodness me. Grow up. Natural selection. It's all about natural selection. Got to pick David Attenborough there. New science and New technologies allow us to travel further and deeper than ever before. Well, I'm gonna love you and leave you. I've been up since the early hours of this morning, meeting the ghost at 12 o'clock. And let me tell you, that was a scary experience. It really was. What a morning it has been this morning. Oh, that's number 50. Two more left. Enjoy the ghost. You will be haunted by three spirits. Expect the second the following Sunday. Remember what has passed between us. Ha, evening, evening. Now it's late at night and I'm in Solo Hall. And I was told by the ghost that he would meet me here. It's the ghost of Christmas presents. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, Merry <laughs> Christmas, Mr. Spence. How are you? Oh, very well, mate. Outside the eights is. <laughs> well, yeah. Happy days. Yeah, well, I live, I live here, mate. Clo Close now. Like the hat. Thank you very much. Excellent. Understated. <laughs> oh, Merry Christmas, mate. Oh, Merry Christmas. Thanks right. What's your favourite holiday? Is it Christmas or would you, is it something else, really? No, nah, it's Christmas. It's got to be Christmas, yeah, 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 isn't yeah. it? What's the favourite part of Christmas for you, Tim? 
uh, the, the favourite bit of Christmas. Yes. I quite and like the week in between Christmas and New Year. Do when you? you? When you haven't got a clue what day it is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just get out of bed at <laughs> nine in the morning and start drinking. I mean, uh, just have a bit of breakfast. And there's still a few good films on. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's grand, yeah, isn't it? I think that's my best part. Still a oh. bit of cheese knocking about as well, isn't there? Yeah, let's get down here. I've got a feeling. Now, I did this with Bob the other night. Damn yeah, and got harassed by some youths. <laughs> yeah, stop for a second. Just have a quick take in the lights. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, and there we go, look. <laughs> All five of them. Oh, it makes you feel festive, doesn't it? <laughs> Boarded up shops, youths and yeah. annoying each other around that Yeah, we're bound to get. We'll get some ice here, I'll tell you. I love it all. Uh, Am I? Hello. Uh, do you know what? Hey. <laughs> What's the best Christmas present you ever received as a child? Oh, um, I actually, I got a toy gun one year and uh, my mum took it off me within about five minutes and hid it and I found it about 15 years later. Uh. And she kept it <laughs> actually still wrapped. Well, why did she take it off you? Well, I didn't think it was appropriate, I suppose. But who bought it for you? Friend of, it was a friend of the family. Oh, right. It wasn't, well, it wasn't like a... You can't confiscate someone's Christmas present. Was it a cap gun or something? Well, yeah, it was a cap gun. I suppose it looked fairly uh, well, really. She, she didn't think it was appropriate because it promoted, I don't know, what Violence. Oh, well, Joined yeah. join the army, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> How do you do your Christmas shopping? Do you do it online or on the high street? Uh, a bit of both. Um, try and get what I can online, but I actually quite enjoy going out and... Try and get what Dude. you can online. <laughs> don't we all, my friend? <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't hate the high street I do, to be honest. We'll uh, run it down. Yeah, no, I don't mind. I don't mind coming out early in the morning and trying to... Early in the morning rush. is key. Because you don't want to, yeah, you don't want to mess about. Oh, it's got some outfits. I wonder if they've got an even song for us. You know, like when uh, the guy from Home Alone runs to the back of that church and they just happen to be singing a beautiful carol. <laughs> doesn't look like it. No, it doesn't, does it? Yes. God is closed for business. <laughs> Are you so creative? Hey! Hey! Oh. Hey. oh. <laughs> Are you joking? Oh. <laughs> 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 Okay. Right, how's the ribs, mate? Yeah, good, thank you. Now, yeah, <laughs> you, you hurt yourself. The, did, did you tell me that the dog locked you out? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, there's no other way of uh, telling that story, but the dog dropped the night latch on me and I couldn't get in. Yeah, um, skillfully done that, really, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. You take the bin out, right, sod him. <laughs> Deadlock. And you rather athletically broke down the door, didn't you? I wouldn't say athletically. <laughs> After about 30 attempts. <laughs> I decided it would be easier to smash the glass instead of trying to get through the door. <laughs> or did you try it like they do on the films where you just boot it? No, I tried with my arm. <laughs> uh, anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. you haven't slept for about two days, yeah. have you? No, anyway, <laughs> move on. You pick your site where you want to put your foot, kick that puppy open. Piece of cake. Yo, oh, look, I always love to pay her a visit. Can I tell you when, else? when, I, was, when I was little? Quite yeah, do you ever put a packet yeah, in yeah. your fingers? <laughs> stick it. There they are, just there. <laughs> oh, that this looks a very fitting place. It's Christmas present time for you as well. Oh, quite okay. Yeah, I've got you some Thank you. Open it. This makes me really, really nervous. <laughs> so I'm just interested to see your reaction. <laughs> right. Thank you, Tim. It's a wonderful <laughs> present. I get, I get to spend my Christmas present from you is uh, is a trip to the Malvern Hills in Easter 2023. Dates to be confirmed. <laughs> to film a mom trail running special. We're going to trail run. Me and you were going to go trail run. Do you know? I'll do. I just. Should we go and get a drink? Okay. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Yeah. Your hat. Your hat is finished. Your hat's died to death. It's absolutely died to death. <laughs> your tinsel is drooping. <laughs> but look, your track of the day was a belter last time. Yeah. What's your track today? I <laughs> see. My favourite Christmas tune is Stop the Cavalry. Love it. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. All right. Stop the Cavalry is my friend. It's left with little more for me to say than like. Like. No, you say subscribe, you fool. <laughs> Let's try it again. <laughs> left with little more for me to say than like, subscribe, <laughs> or fluent. Do whatever. See you next week.